guys, my name is Cal. Today I'm teaching you how to play Brown Sugar by the Rolling Stones. Again, this is going to be the five string Keith Richards setup, um, which is an open G tuning. Uh, the sixth string, which I don't have right now, I'll tell you in a second, is uh, D, G, D, G, B, D. Okay? Open G, um, and I'll put that down in the description if you didn't catch it. Um, so anyway, the song starts off. Um, and real quick, the reason it's five string is because Keith Richards songs, a lot of them are in open G. Um, and he found that he didn't actually need the E string because it just added a sound, uh, a note that he didn't really want, it just got in the way. So all of his songs in open G are mostly just going to be using the top five strings. And so he just took the, uh, the six string off and um, it's called a five string guitar, I don't know. Keith Richards did it a lot, so most of his songs are done uh, in this setup. Anyway, uh, that just starts off uh, up on the 12th fret with your first finger bar down on all the strings. And then you add your second and third finger on the what is normally the B string. And then your third finger on what is normally the D string. Okay? And then for the second note, you just take your uh, second and third off. And then down on the 5th fret, you do the same thing, but in reverse, so... Hit it twice with just your 1st finger bar on the 5th fret. And then add your 3rd and your 2nd finger in the same place that they were on the 12th. And then open, so all together. And that's the intro, and then it goes, and that's up on the uh, eighth fret, and that's down, up, down, up, real fast, get used to that because it's a good uh, picking skill to have, and we use it quite a bit in this song, so, and then you just add your third finger on what is normally the tenth fret uh, G string. back down to the same 5th uh, fret that we just did. And then you go 1st fret, and then up to the 3rd fret, and then up to the 5th. So that section really slowly uh, goes something like this. up to speed. And then for the verse, it's just... alternating between the 5th fret adding your 3rd finger and then the 10th fret adding your 3rd finger. So uh, the last part that he does, uh, it just adds this little lick. Um, it's pretty simple. We actually see it in Can't You Hear Me Knocking. It's just open what is normally your A string. So open A string, slide up from the 3rd to the 4th. Open D, open G, and then slide from the 4th fret on the D string up to the 5th. And then you can even add, which is down to the 3rd on the A, or sorry, the D, and then 3rd finger slide from the 5th up to the 7th. So.
Um, and that's just sort of that lick in between uh, the verse and the chorus. And then he goes back into that part. Um, so that's all the parts of the song, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed that. It was How to Play Brown Sugar by the Rolling Stones. Uh, if you have any songs you want to see me do, feel free to leave those in the comments down below, and hopefully I will get to them at some point. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later.